Let me recommend this book, one of the most remarkable ever penned. Men prefer to believe that they are degenerated angels, rather than elevated apes. The first rational exposition of the relations of mankind to the mystery which shrouds the how and wherefore of man's existence. Our enlightened posterity will look back upon us who eat oxen and sheep, just as we look upon cannibals. If indeed there were a judgment day, it would be for man to appear at the bar not as a criminal but as accuser. It is a sure criterion of the civilization of ancient Egypt that the soldiers did not carry arms except on duty, and that the private citizens did not carry them at all. If we look into ourselves we discover propensities which declare that our intellects have arisen from a lower form, could our minds be made visible we should find them tailed. The supreme power is not a mind, not a force, not a being, but something higher than a being, something for which we have no words, something for which we have no ideas. One book that has influenced the writer very strongly is Winwood Reed's Martyrdom of Man. It is still an extraordinarily inspiring presentation of human history as one consistent process. Open the book of universal history at what period we may, it is always the India trade which is the cause of internal industry and foreign negotiation.